the energy vibration Nathan for um, the Pisces Sun Moon and Rising it is the week of the Pisces birthday so happy birthday to the people who are um, the, the fifth of March until the 11 this is a positive week for you guys this is going to be a powerful year for um, this is going to be a, a extremely powerful year for each and every person because what is happening um, you Pisces this is going to be this year 2018 it's going to be just so wonderful um, happy International Women's Day to all the Pisces and especially to the Pisces people the women who were born on the 8th of March good people good good people and the people who were born on um, the 9th and the 7th of March oh my god you women are just so positive when you're um, vibrating in a positive energy um, uh, it's the earth week and the zodiac energy is, is water so it's going to be powerful let's see what you Pisces have Monday the energy of the lovers isn't this wonderful so this is a positive energy to begin the week with energy of the lover is always a positive energy this is all about your soulmate twin flame this is about intimate relationships okay this is always about intimate relationships it's not about business relationships it's always about intimate relationship it's about that person that you choose to um, go on your journey and spend the rest of your life about and this is what is happening on Monday Tuesday you have the energy of the world my darlings this is the energy of um, the week congratulations again so I'm telling you guys with love especially for um, the people who are having birthdays in this week love and you're you're going to be financially abundant um, relationships are coming to an end and new relationships are forming you're connecting with your twin flame and soulmate it's going to be wonderful um, you have the eight of cups some people will be leaving relationships behind to start out with new relationships and this is going to be wonderful you're going to decide I want to be with that person there's going to be tran transformation but it's going to be positive transformation because um, um, I'm, I'm getting a feeling that some of you have been in marriages that is not making any sense at all or has done what's supposed to be done and now um, you know you are have met someone who as really your soulmate and you want to be with them so you're going to end a relationship um, seven of ones and you're protecting yourself um, some of you are protecting yourself um, and this is that you could be protecting your heart because you don't want to be heartbroken um, from people and situation new um, money is coming in um, for you guys a message about money is coming in for you guys and this is going to be extremely good um, money is coming in for you guys and then on Sunday it's gonna be um, um, you're in an angman position um, on Sunday so um, you don't know you know what's happening there is transition um, you know you're leaving something behind but you don't want to leave it behind um, you're not sure if that's the right reason um, there's a lot of um, situation that is happening for you okay so it's a week where um, some art breaks some art breaks um, art breaks in the sense that you're not sure so I'm, I'm, I'm seeing because art breaks um, endings art breaks whatever is happening there's art breaks coming up for a lot of you um, and 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 it's it's soulmate um, you know certain soulmates certain people decide to move on out of your life and let's see what is happening um, what is carrying the energy of art breaks with these twin flames and soulmate people because um, they're ending something and moving on so um, you know you're protected but you know some of you have uh, are afraid to open up your heart are afraid to move on are afraid to connect with someone and um, but you're you know this is a sacred relationship that is very protective you're thinking of you know I feel are broken because this person has not reach out to me and whatever whatever but it is a sense that you have to ask why this person 
um, call this person talk to this person say hey what's up I haven't heard from you because you never know what happened maybe this person has lost your number or situations like that so you know this is a sacred relationship and this relationship is very much protected you are protecting your heart but this relationship is very much protected because the universal angels and guides know that you two belong together and it's very protected you know sometimes people give each other miss mixed signal and sometimes you're not aware of what is happening in the other person's life because it's maybe something simple as their phone got lost with your number or your number got lost and they are unable to communicate with you so whatever it is you know say you know try and find out whatever has happened is that there was something which was unjust because this is the ten of swords um, somebody you know and 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 um, this is a situation that is coming up and I'm going to ask about it because obviously there has been lies and, and thing but somebody was crucified to the cross it's as if um, someone um, you met someone but it was a sense that you were also crucifying this person to the cross you were sent um, to you know find out things so that you could crucify this person to the cross and um, you're not embarrassed about what you did because really um, you're finding that you know this person is I know this person um, your heart you you got so caught up with this person because it's as if you two had made a contract for um, you two to meet like this um, nine of Pentacles comes up which um, there's a lot of money that is coming out good news is coming about money that is coming to you and a lot of money um, whatever is happening whatever is transpiring um, a lot of you there is going to be a transition a ending of a relationship um, and and it, or ending of something you're moving away from the thing but you're going to end up with some money you're feeling bad because you actually crucified someone to the cross that you know of a fact that the person is not like that or whatever but because of money you have did this and some people are feeling bad at having regrets money is coming up you're walking away from the situation um, but your conscience is um, your guide it has to do with the it has to be with do with you've done this against this person because of this man it is an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius and it's all for money why you did this um, your conscience is your guide in this situation because um, no matter how much money you have and if you have kids think about it because whatever you do to someone always fall on you or your kids okay um, this man is going to be giving you money for whatsoever you have done to the person who you have met um, you're thinking um, you know I, I you know what should I do but your conscience is going to be your guide because um, you fell in love with this person because you fell in love with who the person truly is and your conscience is going to be your guide because all the money in the world is not cannot replace the feelings of love that you have that you have felt what you have felt for this person and at the end of the day when the money is finished you still going your conscience is going to be bothering you about the situation you know okay you have the angman twice oh my god um you guys are really um okay i've never seen this for the pisces reading so i got a lot of questions you have the, the angman twice okay uh, just a lot of stuff is going on with you uh, you know really a lot of stuff because um art breaks you feel are broken over a situation that you have done against someone which you know that is injustice okay you feel as if that person um, don't want to have um, don't want you but it's not true it's just that certain things happen in that person life and um, you need to reach out to that person because you have given that person mixed signal because people do not understand if you said I'm gonna call you and you don't call um, 
another person is not going to call if the other person is very um you know serious about their lives and the rest of it um yeah he said he'll call or she said she would have called or they say they would have called but they haven't called people are like that you know um people have respect for people's life and some people do not understand that not all the time people are there to blow up your phone if you said you will call you don't call then people are just going to take it you feel are broken because you're having these scenarios of this and this and that and the energy of the nine because it's a spiritual week for you um, um pisces because whatever is happening is that this relationship is sacred this is a positive relationship this relationship is actually sacred you're feeling are broken but this relationship is protected this relationship is going to last a lifetime this relationship is actually um, good this relationship is just positive so whatever is happening whatever is transpiring you are having these scenarios but you're not sure because if you say you're gonna call someone don't expect the person to call you and this is exactly what is happening if you said okay I'll call you then the person is gonna wait until you call if you don't call then it's your problem because you were the one who says I'm gonna call you feel so much injustice that it's been done you have received money for something because some of you were not being honest about a situation I should draw your last card to see you know what is this week really all about because um, the energy of the angman because a lot of you are hanging the devil the energy of the, the energy of the um, the devil is in reverse okay so um, this is good because your week is that whatever that has transpired, whatever that has transpired um, with this relationship, because it's as if um, you're ending in this relationship. It's as if you're ending this relationship. It's a soulmate relationship. You're ending it because you feel as if this person doesn't want you, but it is just totally the opposite. You're not aware of what's going on in this person's life. And some of you are aware because some of you were sent in this person's life. And this is how you've met this person. And it's as if you're thinking that this person doesn't want to be with you. And this, you know, you're walking away from this and making a transition. But no matter what transition you're making, you will always, the love for this person will always be there. And um, they are not breaking your heart. You're breaking your heart because you are, you know, conjuring up all of these things. And it is time you give this person a call and say, hey, what's up? And let the person explain. You said you were going to call and then I lost your number. It's just as easy and seriously as that. So whatever is happening, there is two times um the hangman situation so a lot of you are in limbo because a lot of you feel bad leaving the situation not saying goodbye not saying anything about the situation a lot of you especially on sunday the hangman position comes up twice on sunday so um this is a lot of energy and a lot of you are having um regrets um a lot of you are looking at jesus what have i done you know i really feel so much for this person and I'm just I just leave it like this and you're feeling are broken as if this person have broken your heart this person haven't broken your heart you have said you will call you never call so don't expect someone to call you when you said you will call and you never call and then you're going to feel as if this person doesn't want you or whatever is happening no um and 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 what I'm feeling is that um you're going to realize at the end of the week on Sunday that you're going to call this person and say, Hey, what's up? Um, uh, and then realize that, you know, there was actually nothing on the hand. It's just that this person has lost their phone, lost your number, whatever it was, you know, and that it wasn't something serious. So please like, share these videos. Namaste until next week.